Hi, Leslie Perrin here with Peace by Peace Wellness Coaching. Thanks for joining me. I'm your nurse, functional practitioner, and board certified health coach here with Peace Bite number seven. You can manage your stress to manage your joint pain. We all experience stress from time to time. Good stress called you stress is actually important for your body. You stress can be in the form of physical, psychological, or even chemical stress. But when stress is too high or it becomes a chronic issue, it can take its toll on your body, especially arthritis and joint pain that are caused by inflammation. The increased levels of stress hormones that come with extended periods of stress can increase the production of inflammatory chemicals in your body, and this can lead to arthritis flare-ups or chronic joint pain. Unfortunately, this makes your arthritis worse over time and only exacerbates inflammation and pain. You don't have to live with this kind of discomfort. There are ways to manage your stress levels so that you can reduce inflammation and keep your arthritis under control. Managing stress starts with identifying the triggers that cause it in the first place. Take note, for example, of situations or even people that cause stress in your life and really take steps to either minimize or reduce their impact or even avoid them. Next, consider activities that help you relax. Exercise, yoga, qigong, meditation, and deep breathing all have been shown to help reduce stress and its effects on arthritis and joint pain. However, it is important to keep in mind that too intense exercise may actually cause too much stress. So make sure you pay attention to how your body is actually responding to exercise and whether you become too fatigued by a certain activity. Make sure you're taking care of yourself by eating nutrition meal, meals. Proper self-care is important for reducing stress levels and keeping that arthritis under control. Unfortunately, many individuals don't know what foods are right for them or what nutrients they may be deficient in or even how to supplement if supplementation is needed. Diet is one area that may require the support of a functional practitioner. Another self-care tip is to get enough sleep. Quality sleep is essential for your physical and emotional health. Studies have linked poor sleep patterns to arthritis and chronic joint pain, as well as increased stress levels. A lack of restful sleep can make it difficult to manage everyday tasks and leave you feeling overwhelmed and exhausted. Fortunately, research shows that getting the recommended amount of shut-eye like seven to ten, nine hours a night, can really help reduce those stress levels. Proper sleep gives your body time to repair itself and restore energy levels so that you're better able to take on whatever comes your way. It also helps to regulate hormones like cortisol, which are released during times of stress and anxiety. Some triggers of inflammation and joint pain and arthritis may not be obvious to you. If you continue to experience pain, despite taking these measures, you may need to work with a functional practitioner to do further detective work to identify any hidden and underlying causes of inflammation and pain. By fo focusing on managing your stress, you can keep your arthritis flare-ups in check and reduce inflammation as well as associated arthritis pain. So don't let the negative effects of chronic stress stop you from living a healthy life. Take control of your stress and arthritis today. If you have questions or you need help in managing your arthritis or joint pain, I do help individuals with natural ways to rebalance their bodies so they work the way they're supposed to. I use functional labs that individuals can access through in-home test kits and online assessments so that they can understand what stressors may be triggering their inflammation, joint pain, and arthritis flares. To learn more about how natural ways can either help along with medication or in lieu of medication to help you live a healthy life with arthritis or other joint disease, get your free discovery call with me through the link in the description below. Thanks for listening.